Hello everyone, this is Optico here with our first episode of our uh, Minecraft playthrough of Feed the Beast Presents Direwolf 20 1.16. So this is going to be my first foray into the 1.16 mod world. So uh, I haven't, I loaded up a world before I deleted it just to putz around see what changed between, this is my first 1.16 pack, but uh, I want to take you guys on the journey with me. Alright, so... Has a whole list of mods. Things that aren't in this that people might be familiar with are uh, Tinker's Construct isn't in here. All that, like the Tinker stuff, but there is a thing called, where is it? Forget the name of it. Oh, Psy's in here, I love Psy. What is it called, what is it called? Oh, I'm looking for it, guys. There's a cool mod I messed around with for a few minutes. But we are looking for Tetra. Tetra's pretty cool. So this mod, pretty fun. We will uh, mess around with it. It's going to be our Tinker's uh, fix. But let's go ahead and create a world. Let's get in this. Some difficulty, normal, survival. We're going to allow the cheats on just in case I fix something. Uh, more world options. We'll keep that default bonus chest off. Sea world. Up. Decal. LP. DW20. Up to kill. Let's play Direwolf 20 pack. Uh, let's do 1.16. See what it's that about. So, you guys want to play along? There you go. And let's go. Let's get a good world here. All right, we're preparing world for creation. Uh, this is my first video recording, so if something messes up, just let me know. Reum. Hundred percent. Let's see what we got for a world. And all right, what do we got? Oh, we're in a plains biome. I'll take that. Still loading in. There we go. Some water right there, that's not bad. Let's see what the map has for us. I wish I could see, what's this button? Overworld settings. <clears throat> uh, what's this false one? No, no, mini map, true. I wish it would tell us what type of zone it's in. Oh wait, it does. We just don't know that one yet. Okay, sweet. So we got a nice little zone area. Trees down here, lava. All right, let's go. Well, we got Astral Sorcery book, so let's throw that in there. Don't even know what that mod is yet. Uh, we're going to go this way. Mystical white flowers. Oh, perfect. We got a little mountain over there. Let's take a look over there. Nice oak forest. We can start, getting our, start punching some trees. And look at that. A waste of just in the middle of nowhere. We'll take this. Be great, especially when we find the village. All right. Oh, we got. I like this spawn. Oh, 
know, I kind of just want to... The mystical floating block. Be gone, you. Hold on. Yep, skeleton. We're out of here. mistakes you guys notice any mistakes I make feel please feel free to uh, let me know in the comments let me tell you if noise levels are not right all that fun stuff so I can get them set to give you guys a better experience saplings so this little hill right here we'll dig down we'll just make a nice little right here what are you hi sylph all right So we're gonna place this right here. We're gonna call this home. And we activated it. So let's go ahead. Get ourselves a crafting table. that right there so we can put a door right here. All right. We need get that pickaxe. A little bit of lag. It's all right. World's still genning in here. So let's take this, let's grab ourselves a stone pick. Now, there was some coal I wanna say over here. Oh yeah, there's a lot of fun stuff over here. I'll take some flint. Let's go ahead. Let's see one. Let's not waste any items here. Today's goal will be getting a little base set up, make sure we have some lit, and maybe we'll start working in the Tetra to start getting our tools and leveling them up. Sounds about right. Same here. See. I hate 
how slow this is. Look, it's getting Minecraft. Yes, those are real textures. Okay. Ooh, what is this? Ventium. Okay. Uranium. Zinc ore from Create. Bauxite. Never played with Create before. I heard it's pretty cool. Oh, sweet. We got some iron here. Let's go ahead and grab this. Have enough to light up a little base. Is that slimes I see at the bottom left of the map there? That would be amazing. Tetra, we need some diorite, so I'm going to grab a little bit of this. Give me some stone. Alright, we got stone. Let's make our way back to where we're setting up shop. Look at that, a little marble there, that's nice. Oh boy. No mystic skeleton. Oh no, it's the sylph that's there, okay. But... That is a ship. Okay, that's cool. We'll check that out when it comes daytime again. Now, if we're just on an island here, we are. Oh, look at that. That is lush <coughs> flowers. You can see it all there. But we got to see what's this way. We might have to explore a little bit, but I kind of like this whole just <coughs> on our own island. All right, so. Go ahead. <coughs> make four torches real fast. Um, nope. Let's see if it works this way. There we go. Then we'll get a few more of these. The slabs. P. Pressure. Oak pressure. Two. Pl oh, I'm an idiot. We'll get one of those. We'll do this. Perfect. All right. So we'll haul out this area. So there's quartz. A 
Okay, you got some nice new textures here. Wait, did we already get charged? No. Let's go another way this way. So in order to get Tetra started, So we want to need another crafting table. So we'll place this guy, this guy. And then what you do, you get yourself a hammer. Then when you hit it, boom, you got Tetra. So instead of tinkers and having to smell everything, you basically, sorry. You basically just uh, you drop your item in. So let's look at the hammer. And it tells you all the different things. You got the hammer head, everything you could put on it. Um, handles. And basically, it will tell you what you can put for the handles. So I could put sticks as my handle material. So as you see, boom, now it has, now it has a stick handle. Well, flimsy handle. So that's that. Now if I put my pickaxe in here, you can repair it. Repair material will highlight. See how the icons change there? So we'll craft. Take it back. So I have a flimsy handle right now. So handle material stick. If I do that, comes a basic handle. So we don't have any other material that can do that. But we look at the pickaxe head. All the materials that could be pickaxe heads are here and they'll tell you what the difference is, like for this. Workable, durability, damage. So the workable So the workable item, this will go up as you, uh, <coughs> basically that's your speed. So you need a, you have tier two, two tier available. So we have a tier two hammer, pretty sure we do. So we hit craft, half of our pickaxe is flint now. And these things get upgraded. As you see the honing, you can upgrade the parts on them. Enderman. But you can notice significant speed upgrade. Just us a little home here. All right, let's get us a furnace. Pop you down there. And we'll take you. We'll pop the mini coal in there. And we'll also get some chests. Two chests. All right, so let's, so we have regular blocks. 
Oh yeah, and this is the uh, buckboard. It's pretty cool looking. So you have your bows, your blades, your shields. It tells you everything they could be. All the materials. So double-headed. So look, pickaxe. So we look for metal, wood, gemstone, stone. So flint, as you see. Workable goes up. Speed. So workable is your big one. I mean, you also want your, what well, says number two, you want that to go up too. So you want this item, it's your tier. But this make, takes 15% less. So the higher efficiency you get, the better. All right, let's throw the coal in here. Actually, we'll cook them up real fast. And these. This. This. Craftable. We don't need the tome right now. There we go. Alright, it is almost daytime. But we need more flint and gravel. Oh, look at that, some iron. Turn on F7 for a second. Don't know why we froze. All right, Ooh, throw a torch right there. So we got uranium. It's under the power mod, never touched that. We'll figure that out at some point. Uh, anything under there? Nope. Good. I got some more iron under here. Gravel got enough here. This isn't the gravel I was used to. I'm not trying to make a full set of print tools. flint out of that. Alright, so to make a tool, pretty simple. You make it. So let's grab stone, so shovel, axe, and then let's get a sword. Some wood. shovel first. So, flimsy handle, stone, shovel, head. I look at shovel head, head material, flint. So, plus one efficiency, takes 50% less to hone, and deals 4.5, one more damage than stone. We'll take it. Flimsy handle. handle. Throwable. Eh, we don't want it to be throwable. Long handle. Durability a little less, but reach. I kind of like that. So now we got a flint shovel with a long handle. You can see that. Alright, let's throw our axe in here. So we're going to go with axe head. 
We have this. Uh, where's the butt? Tool butt. We have that. And then we're good on the X. And now, I haven't really used this yet, but blade. What are the differences? So we're at a two, uh, where's our damage? Five damage, six damage, 50% more honing. That's a basic blade. What's a heavy blade? All right, heavy blade. I like this. I want to do that one. All right, so we got a, yeah, a stone guard. We have no material for that. All right, let's take our sword and our axe. So there we go. We got ourselves a full set of uh, Tetra tools. Got ourselves a good little start up here. And that will be the wrapping up for episode one. Next episode, we're going to really dive into the mining. Try to upgrade some of our tools. Do a little bit of exploring. See what we have around this beautiful little island here. Maybe something goes on this way. But for that, I'm Optical. Uh, thank you for watching. And I'll see you guys next time.